package. Proceed with removal. <laughs> A book. up your underpants. That's right. Wayne hates that. He says minor girl pants. pants, girl pants. Ah. <laughs> uh, I can't take this anymore, Tony. Maybe this book will help you, Lucian. It's a kind of guide to being a tough guy. Listen. <clears throat> Bullies beware as you get in touch with your inner grizzly. Self-help books never work, Tony. You could at least give it a try. says the first step to becoming a big bear man is to reject the conventionality of clothes. Take our clothes off? That's what it says. Release your hairy grizzly body. I haven't got any hair on my body. Hmm, me neither. How about swamp moss? It does make you feel kind of rugged, Tony. See? What's the book say to do next? Parade your grizzly self proudly in public. Let the world know you're a big bad bear. <laughs> 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 I hate shopping, I hate shopping, I hate shopping, I hate shopping! Just look at them, Wayne. I already did, they're too spotty. Dog legs! Clown pants, Ugh, can we go home now? You are not leaving this shop until you try on some pants. Okay, okay, I'll try them on. He's <laughs> not here, Wayne, in the changing room. <laughs> Maybe that's enough, Grizzliness. <laughs> hey, these are yellow! Too banana! Too eggy! I'm not putting them on! Can't come out until you do! Oh. They're stretchy and snuggly. Let me see, Wade. <laughs> This feels like wearing no pants. Ew. Turn, please. Super durable white bleed perma stretch fabric. Woohoo! Sounds ideal. Stretchy pants. These are cool. I can do all sorts of stuff with these. Look, a hat. They're pants, plain. I'll go pay. A real grizzly does not feel rain or cold. Foster your naked bear spirit. I'm not really sure about this book, Tony. But it says on the front, 100% guaranteed. It's <laughs> Grizzly, do not run from a fight, Lucian. Oh, Wayne, that hurts! 
maybe we should have stood up to Wayne Lucian. Grizzly Mike says... Grizzly Mike! Grizzly Mike! We've had nothing but trouble since we started following his stupid advice. It's about time someone told him this book plain stinks! Uh, I guess you're right. Hey, if you really want to tell him, his address is on the last page. It is? I'm running you a bath, Wayne. You look muddy and filthy. Wayne? I'm sure I saw him come in here. These are double great pants. I'd have thought Grizzly Mike would live in a cave. Hello, can I help you? Yes, we're looking for Grizzly Mike. Oh, <laughs> you'd better come in. I wrote that book a long time ago, boys. We were forced to withdraw it after lawsuits from men who got injured trying to release their uh, inner grizzlies. This is a dangerous book. I don't know where you got it. I thought I had the only copy, and I flushed it down the toilet months ago. This'll be yours. I found it blocking a sewer. Ew, Tony! You're disgusting sometimes. Perhaps you boys might prefer my new book, Butterfly Mike, for the kinder, gentler soul. It tells you how to turn the other cheek when faced with bullies and say, I can't hear you. I'm busy turning into a butterfly. Mike! Have you cut the lawn yet or started the supper? No, dear. I'll get right to it, dear. You'd better go. New pants! I want to wear them! Come on, Mom. Let Wayne wear his special pants. They can't be that dirty. They're still new. No, no, no. These are going straight to my laundry lab. Fine. Then I'm not wearing any! What? Mm -hmm. After all, thanks. Doesn't mean I like you. I know. New pants, Wayne? Yeah, cool, aren't they? They can do loads of things. Like keep my sandwiches vacuum fresh. Oh, Wayne! Snap! You're wearing the same pants as me. <laughs> Very snug, aren't they? And my sister's got a pair like that. And my mom! You know what this means, don't you? Wayne's wearing girl pants! Girl pants! Girl pants! Girl pants! Girl pants! Girl pants! Ah! <laughs> Get out of that, cocoon features! I can't feel the cold, Wayne. I'm turning into a butterfly. <laughs> Okay, I'm cold now, Wayne. Get these pants off me, Wayne! Wayne! I need two desserts, lady. I have a sugar shortage. I'm a good boy. It's medical! Ask a dentist! Hey! <laughs> hey, Wendy, I wanted that! Can it, geek girl? Copy me, dress monster! And leave me alone! 
<sighs> Desserts aren't good for you anyway, Mari. Yeah? Well, I like desserts. I'm fed up with being a geek girl. Total revenge and... And fist of fingers? Never like war films or kickboxing before. So, I'm changing my image, Lucian. Deal with it. Are you really 18? Hurry? It's part of an animal you're wearing. I couldn't decide between the pink ones and the green ones. They're kind of mix and match. Huh? You owe me dessert. Okay, shoot, Pooh. Now scram! Here, Mari. Um, why are you giving me that, Wayne? Because I just wanna. It was nothing. Two for one, special offer! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> Mari! What? I don't want to be a geek girl anymore. Wow, girl pants. I never realized your friend was so cool. Okay, Mari. What is this all about? You trying to get Wayne or something? Because if you are... <laughs> get Wayne? Don't be gross. I just want some respect. Hey, Mari. Wanna form a gang? You and me? We can both get respect. Ugh. Nah. Uh-uh. I mean, they do look tough. And I am in a gang, but isn't there something tough that's, like, pretty? Tough tights. <laughs> Today we're going to learn. Move over, nature boy. I need to get next to Mari. We're a gang. This is great, Wendy. I mean, I, I love all this. should not behave like this. Huh? Why shouldn't girls behave like this, Lucian? What's the matter? Are you too much of a sexist pants to accept my new image? Maybe I really am a sexist. Thank you, Lucian. Oh, such a gentleman. <gasps> I'm holding the door open for a lady. Sexist. Wow, Wendy. I have never had so much room in the playground before. Oh, boy games and girl games. How predictably sexist. Why shouldn't boys join in girl games if they want to? <laughs> Yeah. Only, uh, I 
can't, cause, cause you're girls. Oh yeah, we're girls. You can't hit a girl, but a girl can hit you. Ah! Hey, Wayne, give those back. What's the matter? Don't you think boys should be allowed to play with Teddy's lady baby? Stupid girl pants girl. I'll show them. Mom, as a... A girl, I, I mean, a, a lady, woman, women. Do, do you think I'm sexist? Oh, Lucian, I don't think you're an anythingist. If boys were meant to do girl things, they'd be born with long hair and dresses. But girls aren't born with. Don't contradict your mother, Lucian. Lucian Cramp? Present. Wayne Cramp? Attention, Wayne! I called your name. I'm not Wayne, I'm a new girl. Uh, uh, uh. My name is Wynona. Where is Wayne today, nature boy? Hmm. We're first. Oh, ladies first. That's so sexist. Ugh. Ow. 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 Lady babies last. Hello, I'm Winona. I'm a bad girl. You look like bad girls, too. Can I be in your gang? Hey, wait, where you going? I can't go in there. Why not? Uh, I just don't need to go right now, you know? We're having a gang meeting, Winona. If you're in, you come in. What are we having a meeting about, Mari? Ah, uh, there are no wee wee things. <laughs> <laughs> that girl's really weird. And her hair, she needs conditioner bad. Oh. Oh, hi, girls. I'm uh, feeling better now, and uh, I have an idea. Let's go find some enemies. Enemies? Yeah, so we can fight! Uh, uh, what's the point of being in a gang if you're not gonna fight? Well, I happen to like being at the front of the line and getting to eat my dessert. Come on! I know the perfect enemies! This is getting stupid. I wish Wayne was still following us. I bet he'd love to see me fighting. <laughs> enemies! There's only girl gang in Midtown. And you're not even a proper girl gang, because you got a boy member. No, we don't. Yes, Wendy, we do. Ah! Give it back, Mari. If I'm not a girl, I can't fight them. your teddy tails back. Uh, thanks, Mari, but... Uh... I'm giving up on gangdom. It was cool to have extra play space and dessert, but violence was never my thing. Sorry I pushed you down, Lucian. Wanna push me back? No thanks, Mari. It's all right. And anyway, I can't. You're a girl. Oh. You're a 